hello guys in this video we'll going to discuss about uh, riper and scrappers and all other your construction equipments we have already discussed about your bulldozer okay and your tractor so in this video we'll going to discuss about riper okay so riper is basically um, a excavating machine for loosening layers of frozen soil okay for, or you can say rock and artificial surfaces in layer using the tractive force of a prime mover okay you can see here the figure of your paper okay so see here this one is what diaper okay so basically this equipment is used for your excavation purposes okay so ripers are used in construction together with the uh, other excavating machines to prepare foundation pits okay and trenches and they are also used for stripping work in open pit mines that means this kind of equipment or this kind of construction equipment have a high tractive force you can see here truck trucks are there okay bulldozer uh, trucks are present in this case also trucks are present so basically this equipment what it intended purpose is this is used to form is uh, form the soil wedges okay this is basically used to form the soil wedges now how they are formed you can see the strong jaws are here strong jaws are here this one okay this will create a high impact on the soil surfaces this equipment so generally this uh, create an impact on high impact on soil surfaces and make the soil uh, to break in different wedges okay so you can see the teeth like structure okay pointed structure this will strike on the soil surfaces so uh, as you know in uh, construction site maybe this uh, uh, soil surfaces will be un undulating or somewhat maybe level surfaces so this pro this creates a base for the excavation okay it will it will impact on the soil surfaces and create the soil wedges okay so that that can be lifted by your uh, what your you can say jcb or you can say backhoe okay so this can be uh, excavated or this mass soil mass can be lifted so this will generally provide the base for the excavation okay by creating soil wedges okay so next equipment is your scapper Okay. Scappers is a toward machine which is used to level the surface of ground by stripping away earth or by collecting earth and filling hollow areas. Okay. So you can see the schematic diagram of your what? Scapper. Okay, basically this is the schematic diagram. You can see here all components of your scappers. Basically this equipment is generally used for loading of materials. Okay. Uh, and you can say transportation of materials for short distances okay but best possible results gives for transportation material for short distances okay okay you have to move in site uh, suppose for carrying of material takes place then you can use this uh, vehicle for transportation purposes okay it has a great advantages what is the advantages see here here bowl is present okay you need uh, we need to store here what soil mass okay any kind of excavation inside you can store the soil mass here and um, for example uh, we want to fill a uh, part holes or something that is uh, some kind of undulating in grounds we have to make the ground level so that uh, in that cases we can use the uh, soil wedges or soil masses to fill the uh, fill the hurdles and you can uh, label it using by this equipment okay so this is the basic purpose of what scapper okay. a fast shovel okay the primary function of this piece of plant is to excavate above its own uh, track or field level they are available as a universal power unit based machine or you can say hydraulic purpose designed unit okay. these machines can usually excavate any type of soil rock which needs to be loosened 
okay loosened uh, by uh, some suitable means like uh, blasting okay blasting generally uh, you done by using what dynamite prior to excavation fresh soils are generally required attendant haulage vehicles uh, for the removal of spoils and a low loader transport lorry for travel between sites okay you can see here the arrangement okay i'm using the marking pen so that you can clearly understand what is going on see here okay first statement is that what excavation is done above the wheel level okay you can see here this is wheel level okay uh, all the excavation works are uh, above your wheel level next one is your what uh, it is guided with your what a transport lorry okay you can see here this is fitted with a mast that is known as your what boom boom okay disconnected with boom then you can see your strop is there so this kind of instrument generally takes place with a roof and pulley arrangement steel roof and pulley arrangement okay you can see the bucket here which is needed to excavate the soil wedges okay all the equipment arrangement okay. next construction equipment is your backhoe okay so basically this construction equipment you might have seen in every large project construction site okay you might have seen this equipment at your uh, construction of your highway as you can say um, at places where demolition works are uh, are going on and where uh, you can you can say your filling works are going on okay so this is a popular excavating and filling machine you can say so backhoe can dig all sorts of holes but it's specially suited for digging ditches what do you mean by ditches ditches means a narrow channel dug at the side of the road or field okay the to use the backhoe the operator has to park the truck tractor and turn the set around you can see here all the components of your backhoe okay it serves dual purpose by its two units that is your backhoe for excavation and loader for your back filling okay you can see here okay so this part is known as your what backhoe okay this part is called your backhoe Okay, this part is known as a backhoe, and this portion is known as your what loader. Okay, so so backhoe is used for what excavation. This unit excavate, and this unit here fill the hollow surfaces on the road surfaces. You can say. So basically, this is used for your. Uh, two purposes so multi purpose that means widely used in construction okay so two purpose can be done by using your backhoe one is your back filling you can say fill the material on the surfaces and other one is your digging ditches that means also digging purposes which is used next construction equipment is your drag line okay so this construction equipment is commonly used in coal mines you can say and ev almost every digging purposes it is used for example so these are used for road port constructions pond and canal dredging dredging means what excavation and your as uh, pile driving reeds okay so this equipment is a, you can say a smaller version of crane okay the many purpose of drag line is dredging okay dredging of different kind of your uh, construction activities so as example i already said that pond canal okay drag lines fall into two broad categories okay those that are based on standard lifting cranes and the heavy units which have to be built on site okay so basically crane do what lift lifting uh, 
different different construction equipment from one place to another so mm, this can be used for lifting as well as your dredging purposes okay so you can see here okay so you can see uh, steel rope is there and it is a boom is there okay bucket is there which is used for your uh, dredging purposes 